Good morning guys. I'm starting this video in the morning very early. It's around 5.50 so I am about to go to the gym and I just wanted to show you that I got the Alani products that I've been wanting. This is the creatine, that was the super greens, and I got the um, protein powder that I'm going to have after my workout. So I just wanted to try these real quick on camera for you guys so I can like get my reaction and I'm like so excited like so excited okay so i have the both creatine and greens in the here and i'm gonna drink a little bit of this and then add my pre-workout as i get down to the bottom doesn't smell bad you're joking This actually doesn't taste bad. This actually tastes really good. Like, it, it doesn't have, like, a flavor per se, but it doesn't taste like you're, like, dry eating spinach, you know? So, I'm going to finish some of this, do my devotion, and then head on out to the gym. Today is a full body day. I don't know if I said that or not, but yay. <sighs> okay, so I'm back, and I'm absolutely dead. I, like... I've been watching full body workout videos on YouTube to try and get some inspiration. Man, man, I destroyed myself. I tried the Stairmaster for the first time and it absolutely destroyed me, I swear. Like, I only, I think I only did about 10 minutes of it, but like, I thought, I thought I was gonna die. I thought I was gonna die. But I thought that the first time I did a 12, 3, 30. So I think we're gonna keep doing it and see how it goes. But look what we have, we have the, Alani protein in peanut butter brownie. I'm s I love peanut butter and brownies are like one of my favorite desserts. So like probably in the top three up there with cheesecake. <laughs> I don't know. Um, but we about to try it. I have my almond milk. That's my water. And I cleaned out my greens cup from this morning and we are about to try this out. Okay, so the directions say to add one scoop to six to eight ounces of water or milk, I think. Yeah, and here we go. I've never actually done protein shakes before. I've like never made one. Put protein powder in smoothies, but I've never made like a protein shake. She gets it right. Alani gets it right every time. And I love how this says 30 servings, but this is gonna last me probably for the rest of the year. And I'll make protein smoothies probably four times a week or protein shakes, cause this, this is busting up good. My pre-workout said it had 25 servings and it's lasted me three months. And that's like a full scoop almost every day. So it's definitely worth the coin. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to finish this. It's only about 7.45 in the morning. So I'm gonna wait till maybe around 8.30 to eat my breakfast. I have an amazing breakfast. I made a little sausage biscuit and I got some grits because I was feeling like home. I'm from South Georgia, so grits are a absolute staple. And then I'm gonna do some peanut butter and I got some fruit. So we are rolling and I'm so excited. So it is about 1.30 now and I'm looking mega crusty, but I just finished a paper and I've been to class and I am just going to do some studying on some stats and yeah, so breakfast filled me up so much this morning. So I just had a granola bar for lunch and I'll probably get something right before I leave to go home and I'm so excited. So. Yeah, that's basically my update for right now. It's getting colder, so I got to finally wear a sweatshirt and like that that makes me so happy. I love fall fashion. I love my sweaters. I love my browns, my oranges, so really excited for that. Hey, buddy. <laughs> hey guys, so it's kind of been a while since I've, you know, picked up my camera and filmed, but I went home this past weekend and it was amazing. I really needed that. And yeah, this morning was back in by day and I, it's getting colder. So, you know, busted out the long sleeves again. It was really nice. And 
I had a good workout. Today was my like run day. So like I ran before my workout and I just, man, I wasn't feeling it today. I really wasn't, but um, yeah, we got through it and I feel great. And I'm gonna get ready real fast because I want to like look kind of cute today and wear my sweater, which is fun. And then, yeah, I'm gonna go practice piano and go to work and get some breakfast love breakfast i actually got a new pre-workout because i like completely ran out of my other one i had that for like three months it said it only had 25 servings but it lasted me so long so i got the alani galaxy lemonade i love lemonade so i was like this is gonna be good and it really is so that's fun every morning i've been drinking my greens and my creatine and i don't know if i'm just like psyching myself out or like placebo but like after like my quad days and like my leg days, like my legs look good. <laughs> like they look so good. Like once I, when I flex them, I can see the muscle and I'm like, is it the creatine or am I just like placeboing myself? I don't know, but I'm, I'm really hyped about working out and I'm really excited. And I'm like in the habit now of waking up at 5.45. It's so weird. Like college students are supposed to sleep in, but I don't know. It gives me like, drive I guess to wake up early so I need to get ready right now so my hair is like absolutely a mess right now but I saw where some people and Libby does this on her channel is she takes her coffee and she mixes it with a Alani fit shake and I really wanted to try it I know they sell like protein coffees at Alani but I just like I wanted to try, try this out because I already have the protein shake. Not really much of a coffee drinker. Like, I got this because I, oh my gosh, <laughs> because I thought I would be, but turns out I'm really a tea person, but I wanna use this up. So that's what I'm gonna do. So I have a little bit of coffee in here. Then put in the fit shake. Oh, wow. Oh my gosh, that's really good. And I still have half a protein shake left. Oh, wow. Put some ice in this. I'm gonna do a little makeup and I wanna look cute today. I got my little sweater on. I'll show you a little OTD. O -O -T -D. It's not too special, but I'm gonna put some ice in here, do some makeup, and I am going to get going. have the fit this sweater is from pack sun and i think it was from like the brandy section i don't know because i don't own anything from brandy melville but i think this was like in the brandy melville section these are my favorite jeans i've had them for like two years they're from american eagle i probably need to get some new ones because they're a little big and then the classic chucks the the white converse let's go Just finished my practice piano I love playing piano I've been playing for about 12 years and Chopin is my favorite I just love it so much I'm not a music major because I don't know I like to do music for fun not work but I have to go to work now so I will see you there I'm probably gonna do some schoolwork and I have some assignments that I have to do for work so that's cool guys I have made an irresponsible decision, but that's what being young is about, right? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so I got a Gymshark package because I ordered a bunch of stuff off Gymshark. So we are gonna open it together. Okay, so the first thing, Roost Training Bra, I got the white one. And then I also got the black one. Libby Christensen has inspired me to buy these and maybe it'll work on my confidence in the gym. I usually wear a t-shirt and let's see, I got the white training t-shirt um, in a medium. So I'm excited about that. 
And then these are the Energy Seamless shorts. They, they're like usually not in stock, but I've found them in my size and they came in stock. And then these are the Chili Red Marl shorts as well. I got a lot of shorts. Let's see. And then the last thing I got was, I think these are the Sweat shorts in teal. So I'm going to do a little try on later on. And I'm super excited because there is a spin class at my college gym at 6.30. So I'm going to go to that. I've never been to a spin class and I'm gonna wear my new Gymshark. Anyways, I'm super excited about this. I can't wait to try it on, but now I have to go to my piano lesson and do that. And then I'm gonna come back, study, go to cycling, and then come back and study some more. So that's gonna be my night. I changed my shirt because it gets a little hot towards like the middle-ish of the day. And I put on the Black Roost training bra. Y'all, like at first I was like, do I regret spending this much money on Gymshark? And then you look at what you got and you're like, how did I spend that much on like six things? But like I tried it on and I do not regret it at all. Like. Oh my gosh, Libby gets it right. She doesn't steer me wrong. I'm gonna get like every color in these. I'm gonna save my money. I'm, oh my gosh. And I haven't even tried on the rest of the pieces and I already love it. So I'm super excited. Here we have on the Energy Seamless and I feel all secure. And they're so, they're like a, it's like a workout material you think. It's squat proof and I'm, look, like even if I wear it with this, like, I'm okay if I like, like you can still see the shorts, which is awesome. And this is very oversized. Here we have the Sweat Seamless Collection. I actually like, these are a lot softer than the Energy Seamless. And I'll, yeah, like to the touch. And look at the, the color is so pretty. So these are the Vital Seamless in Chili Red. And I think these might be my favorite out of all of them. They're just like, all around like nice and I feel like they fit me great. I don't know, maybe it's maybe it's the red. I don't really get much red, so, oh my gosh. I put on the white roots training bra under this and it looks so good with the red and I'm so excited. This is the training shirt. It's just a regular t-shirt. I think I might send it back though because it is see-through, so be aware of that. And I don't know, I really do like it, but I would probably get a different material. I don't know. I don't know, I'm gonna think about it. I really want one of the legacy shirts and I don't know what those are like, but this is still a great quality t-shirt. Nonetheless, it's just not, it's just see-through, so. I forgot to say, but I am in a small in all of these bottoms and this shirt is an oversized medium. And for my bra size, I am a medium. I prefer the medium over small. I might could size down, but I just feel more comfortable in a medium. Oh my gosh. I don't think I'm gonna be able to walk tomorrow. That spin class was absolutely insane. My quads are burning, my glutes burn a little bit, and I don't know what I'm gonna do because tomorrow is a leg day for me, but I think I'm just gonna do some Pilates tomorrow because I haven't done Pilates a lot, but. I know it burns and I know it usually works. So I have my dinner and it's, it's just a chicken breast and some other stuff. I got some Dijon mustard with it because if I eat a dry regular chicken breast, that would like, who does that? Not someone who wants to have a good life. So I'm going to eat this, do some homework and then do a late night grocery run. I think I need some, um, granola bars to snack on and all that stuff. So I'm going to get to work. Well, Kroger run unsuccessful because I go out to my car and it's completely dead. Not even like battery dead where it's like cranking up or trying to. It's like, I turn the key, silence, dead, nothing happening. Just drove up on Sunday and I don't know what's happening. My dad said it might be the alternator since it's like not turning on at all, but I don't know how to get it to like an auto zone. I don't know. So let's see what happens from here. My car is like the only transportation I have. I have an 09 Honda Accord and she's a little trusty car, but I don't know what, what's going on with her. So we're gonna need to figure that out. 
Good morning guys, today is Wednesday and I did something a little different this morning. It's 6.50 right now. I got up at my usual time, 6.45, 5.45 and I was like, today I wanna do some Pilates. I don't know, did, like this week I was like, let me try and do like a full leg day, my back and buys, and then a Pilates day, like a Pilates booty day kind of, and abs, and I didn't really like it. So like, I mean, it was fine. I just, it's not my usual routine where I'll like, I'm gonna make a protein shake while I do this. It wasn't my usual routine where I get up and I take my pre-workout and I go to the gym. Like, it didn't seem like it was like my routine. I don't know. It was good to try, but I don't think that I'm going to maybe do that again. Um, I love Pilates, like abs Pilates. That has me dead. Abs Pilates has me dead, but just like, regular like I don't know booty Pilates leg Pilates I don't know and my legs are sore from yesterday's spin class so I like it was like hurting to do leg workouts and I was like oh but I did a Pamela Reef workout um, for abs and she killed me of course and I did another Pilates booty workout and I don't know that was like my daily workout, I'm pr I might go on a run or I might do some hit later. But right now I'm going to have my protein shake and I'm gonna figure out how to get my car fixed. It's basically what's going on in my life right now. I wanted to try and visit my friend in Athens this next weekend, but I don't know if that's gonna work out. So wish me luck on how to figure that out. I'm gonna do my devotional and probably study a little no i'm gonna read because i haven't read in a while i started the last thing he told me and i would like to finish it today um that might be a stretch but we're gonna see about it hey guys so a little update i have studied i've eaten dinner i've done all that i'm pretty pooped out i don't know my brain's just kind of fried at the moment i'm gonna it's 7:40. So I'm just going to kind of take some time right now. I did a lot of studying. I studied econ and I did some math work and some Spanish. Those are like my three big classes. And I went to band and I went to a sectional. So I did a lot of music practice today as well. So tomorrow is my shoulders, chest, and tries day at the gym. And I'm going to the gym. I might even take an Alani like workout drink. I don't know, I might treat myself to that because, I don't know, like, right now, like, I'm I'm good, I'm just meh, I guess, because I just miss, like, human communication, I mean, like, I talk to people, and I have friends, but, like, I don't have, like, a friend, like, I, it's more of, like, acquaintance type things, so, yeah, that's where I'm kind of at right now, but... Uh, my honestly my escape is the gym and I do love being alone I really do and I find just fulfillment in that so yeah that's basically what I'm doing now I am going to watch the Big Bang Theory because I am on season four now and I really want to finish it because I love this show so much it's coming in close it's a close second to the office office is still number one but I'm gonna take some time and I'm gonna watch some Big Bang Theory and probably some YouTube and go to sleep for the night so I'm trying a new tea this morning. It's called Chocolate Pura, I think. And it said it has high caffeine and I'm feeling that this morning because I forgot to take my pre-workout. And during my whole sh shoulders, chest, and tries day, I was like absolutely dead because I didn't want to wake up this morning. So I'm boiling some water, gonna put it in my cup, make this, I'll put my creatine in it. I think that's something that I can do because it's flavorless but I need to get going I'm hungry because I want some breakfast and we are going to get this day started I came back from work and then I went to the library and studied for about two hours today's like I only have one class today and this is just like my study day so I have time to study and I studied Spanish for two hours and now I'm going to go back. I just had my econ class. So I'm going to review econ and study some econ because I have an exam exactly a week from today. Oh my goodness. And then hopefully I can get some stats in. And yeah, 
that will be my study day pretty much. Look at here, we got the Suzmobile back and we are about to go to Kroger right now, do our weekly Kroger haul, Kroger run, you know, the car talks, the grocery hauls, all that stuff. I, I look excited and I sound excited and I am excited because we're gonna do the Kroger run, probably go to Aldi too because they're cheaper. And I'm going to finish um, the last thing he told me. This book is so good. I don't, I don't know why I put off reading it for so long, but I literally was like a quarter way through it today and now I'm almost finished, almost finished, almost finished with the book. Like, it's just crazy, but let's go to Kroger. Grocery time. Okay, so I'm back from a college youth night. So before college worship, I went to Aldi and Kroger and then I was like zoom in to college worship because I was kind of late, only like two minutes though. And then I stayed for like an hour after talking to all the people, they were so nice. And then I was like, I really want some Milani shakes because they were on my list. And I was like, Walmart has them. So I go to Walmart at like 10 o'clock at night. And I'm just gonna say never again because the people in there were, I'm sorry, they were a little sketch. And alone, I'm sorry, I didn't feel comfortable alone, but that's okay. And I'm here for the grocery haul. First, I'm gonna start with the things from Aldi's. So I got some protein bars. They're the cheapest at Aldi's. I think these were only like 250 each around and 10 grams of protein, around six grams of sugar, which is a little high, but I mean, sometimes you have to compromise a little bit for the price. Next, as a little treat, I got myself some dark chocolate. This is 85% dark. I love dark chocolate. Like instead of like as a study reward, I've been looking this up to like reward yourself. I have like a piece of chocolate and dark chocolate isn't bad for you. So I'm really excited about this. I got some just plain non-fat, zero sugar, like plain as day Greek yogurt because what I wanna do is I wanna make some protein powder with it. I've seen Linda's son do that and she loves it. And I can take some fruit from D Hall and I can put it in here. So I'm gonna do some strawberries. I brought some chia seeds from home and some granola from home. And I also got some more granola. So that's so that's what I'm planning on doing with this. Here's the granola I'm talking about. Um, this was the only one that was like the lowest in sugar and and fairly cheap. Like I prefer to make my own granola, but since I don't have like the tools to make it in college, I can't make it here. The last two things I got from Aldi was another almond milk. I just got the just original plain flavor. And then this is a new one that I saw. I didn't know they sold like the good coffee at Aldi. So I was pleasantly, pleasantly surprised. Um, I don't like super like strong coffee. Maybe I have to work up to that but I do like cold brew and I don't know. I just wanted to try this one out. I like the stock coffee. That's the one I use in my protein coffee things. And let me just say I'm obsessed with them. So let me move on to what I got from Walmart cause that will go along with the protein coffee. Not one, not two, but three Alani shakes. Okay, this makes me so happy. I'm finally getting to try the fruity cereal flavor. I want to try all of them, but I was like, Susie, that kind of costs money. And then I got two vanillas for my protein coffees. And I can use like half of one for one cup of coffee, like one big pretty, one pretty big cup of coffee. So this can give me about four, maybe five cups of that coffee. Um, I'm more of a tea girl, honestly, but some days I just need a pick me up. And honestly, like this thing was $3, like $3.50. And that's really good for cold brew coffee. So honestly, like a coffee can cost me less than $5, which is great. At Walmart, they did have the cookies and cream and chocolate and I was debating on getting them, but I did not. And yeah, honestly, that kind of concludes my grocery haul. I didn't find anything at Kroger because I don't know, prices at Kroger are going up and I forgot to get cashews, but that's okay. I'm really excited about my grocery haul. And yeah, this day has ended off pretty good. Last week I wasn't in very good of a headspace. I don't know, college was kind of driving me crazy and I miss my parents and I don't know. Now I'm doing good and I spent some time with people, which is amazing. I love, 
I'm an introvert, but I still need time with people as well. And I don't know. I just think that things are starting to look up and I'm visiting my best friend in Athens, Georgia this weekend. So that's also what I'm looking forward to. So I leave tomorrow afternoon. And yeah, I think that's where I'm gonna leave off the video for this week. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And you know, I do this just to have someone to talk to, honestly, and it kind of helps with my public speaking. So I love you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like, I don't, I don't want to do this for anything just besides someone to talk to because that's what I need right now. <laughs> I don't know. So I will see you in my next video. I hope these don't get monotonous because I kind of do the same thing every vlog and I kind of do the same thing every day, but that's okay. I hope you guys have a great, great week and I will see you in the next video.